Hello and welcome to RuneScape. Uh, I am just making a guide for flesh crawlers, uh, for peers, level 1 to 25 defense, I guess. Um, I recommend having about 100k to start, because you will need a weapon and some food, uh, at least. Um, I recommend at least combat level 40. Maybe th 35 might cut it if you're a range base. Um, okay. For what you should wear, if you are melee, you should wear... Basically, the, this is the cheaper look if you um, don't have much money. Like, if you're just starting out, uh, that's the cheaper look. And then, the more expensive look, or with it, you add a team cape. And, um, yeah, you add a team cape. And then the more expensive look would be this with the glory, Brian Saber, because Brian Saber has higher strength bonus. Uh, third one would be r range. Uh, there's one method, or you could use this. And and if you're a mage base retard, I do not recommend going here because it is retarded. Okay, let's start the guide. Okay, I'm back. Uh, I recommend bringing tuna or better, and I'm gonna be doing the melee based. So, yeah. Okay, I will show you how to get there now. Basically, you go from Grand Exchange, or Edgeville Bank, this is, I'm taking the Edgeville Bank route because I use the glory to tell you back for quick telly out, so I can get more money faster and train a lot faster. Yeah, um, also tell me if my quality is good on this video because this is my first actual video, and tell me if like my sound quality is good. I know there's this little humming thing in the background probably, it's kind of going zzzz or something, um, but... I'm going to get a separate mic that's not connected to my computer, so I can actually not have that horrible sound quality. Um, yeah. Then you basically just walk over here, and it ends up taking you to the middle of the first level. You go past the Gift of Peace, and down the ladder again. Then you go, you don't go through the portal this time, but you go over through these doors that are on the south, the south doors. Then you go through the maze thing. Um, if they attack you, it's no big deal. Like, I don't think they do. Like, they're too slow. Um, and then there's zombies up here. Run straight through them. Don't walk. Because they can hit fives and sixes and stuff. And that'll just drain everything. Like they just did. Then you go through south again. And go all the way to the next south one. And now you are at Flesh Colors. Welcome here. Basically, you pick up the fire runes, the dust runes, and the nature runes. Nature runes can pile up. Um, also pick up the noted iron ore, not the regular iron ore, but only the noted, because in one run you can get about 12k worth of noted, which is basically a Reyna. Kill stealers for the win. For the win. Um, and then, so basically just pick up those three... Um, Na uh, runes, uh, noted iron ore, and pick up, like, Raynar's, Quarm, Cadentine, uh, what? Iron, Torflex. Iron, Tor there are no Torflex here. Nice try. Um, here's the noted iron ore. It's like this. Uh, you can get about 70, you should be able to get about 70 per run. Sometimes you don't get any, just because it's weird like that. Um, these are the defense noobs that I absolutely hate here. Like, really? I'm the only peer here right now. That's a good thing that I'm the only peer here, because I'm the only one who actually knows how to kill steel. Huh? Like, these, these people... Okay. You pick up the dust runes while you're raiding. Oh, more iron ore. I basically pick up everything, even if it wasn't my kill. Wow. He's picking up dust runes too, see? Maybe he's been seeing some someone's guide that I... Got off of. 
Th that's mainly the reason I'm making this. Don't pick up Marintel, Guam, or Tatraman, Terraman, or whatever. Um, because they're not worth more much, but pick up Hallander or better, price-wise. Okay, so basically, you just attack these, and then once you have the full inventory and you've ran out of- Once you've ran out of food and you're kind of low on health, and you're ready to go, you basically- Hang on, I'm, I'm gonna finish killing this one. You, ba you basically just, like, once you're out of food, you're at low health, and you're ready to go, all you do is teleport to Edgeville. Their max hit is 1, by the way, so you can, if you don't have a ring of life, just kind of tell you out, like, 8, like, 8 hit points, 10 hit points higher than your, like, since I'm 60 hit points, my ring of life activates at 6, so I'd leave there at about 10. Okay, so basically that's all you do, and then you go to sell them to the Grand Exchange, and you should make about... I'll show you a clip of how much I make every run. I'm back with my inventory after doing one run of flesh crawlers. And for having one defense and one pre Oh, I got a level up. Cool. I didn't even notice that. Okay. Yeah, no, I didn't actually. Um and basically I got I I always pick up my my charms. Like you don't have to do that if you're making money, but I do it just cuz I'm eventually going to get summoning. Um See, I, see, I have my noted iron ore, my nature runes, dust runes, my fire runes, and then all my herbs. And I picked up these because they're decently, I guess. So now, we... where's the radar? Where is, where is a radar? Where, where? Okay, I think I only got one radar this run. Yeah, I did. I know that looks bad, but they're about the same as... Harlander, I did not know that, so, um, I picked up a little bit of everything, because I was, like, at the last minute, I had, like, two pieces of food left, so I just started to pick up everything, so, it, it is pretty good, you can pick up everything if you think you should, but I don't recommend doing that if you have ten defense or higher, um, yeah, so basically, this is what you get every single time you go. Maybe a little more, maybe a little less. Sometimes, I'll, m most of the time, a lot less if you're one defense. So I actually did pretty good this run. Okay. Well, um, thank you for watching my guide. Comment, rate, subscribe, you know, what everyone else says after the end of the video. Okay. Thank you. Oh, um, and also leave a comment on my channel, not on the video, but on the channel, saying how, like, if you thought this was good screen quality and, like, good uh, overall quality, sound quality, everything, and, um, please rate five stars, don't rate one star just because you're a douche, okay, thanks. Uh, she got that good, good. She Michael Jackson bad. I'm attracted to her for her attractive ass. And now we murderers because we kill time. I knock her lights out.